Hello and welcome. Happy Friday, everybody. TJF, how's it going? Happy Mother's Day soon. Um, I know that's coming up. I've been happily making your orders and shipping them. I really appreciate it. We're waiting for Michael Butterfield. We're talking about this custom pearl bra, pearl harness for making. Hi. Hi. Yay. You can get some people in here. Awesome. Hi. Hey, how are you? Nice to see you. Good to see you too. Long time no talk. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Yes. Mm. Welcome everybody. Happy Friday. We're super excited to see you. We have a lot planned. We like talked about a lot, so we'll see if we'll get through all of it. But oh yes. How's it going? How's your week? Good. It's been a little slow in terms of work, but other than that, I'm, I'm not complaining. I've just been cooking a lot. I just finished uh, making dinner for everyone. I nice. made a keto chicken Parmesan. Ooh. Mm -hmm. So I actually realized that you just use, um, I mean, like it's almond flour instead of flour and that's, and instead of breadcrumbs, oh. it's um, Parmesan, like the, the strips, like the shredded Parmesan cheese. And it makes oh. it into this perfect breadcrumb crust that you, just throw in the oven, put some some Rayo sauce and some cheese, and it's good to go. Yes, I love all of this. And welcome, everybody. We're super excited to have everybody here. We've been, like, prepping for this. Yes. We're talking a bunch of fun stuff today. So really yes. I brought this it's going to be so good. I carried this animal on my bike for y'all. Oh, my God. <laughs> it is like, this is it's little. This is all I need, and this is still plenty. It's, <laughs> it's so nuts to me because I literally have not seen an anvil that tiny. I'm so used to like the Acme Looney Tunes anvils that like landed on like one of the characters and they're still somehow alive. But oh, this that's what I'm used to seeing. So this is like crazy to me. This is definitely. If you actually feel this, this is lethal for sure. I. It, it looks very <laughs> lethal still. <laughs> Not, it's not cool. This is a good weapon. But this, this is how I, this is good for like forming rings and then doing flat edges. If I'm doing mini forming for like little sculptures, I can get small. Oh, wow. like, like, I don't form any <laughs> ever. Like, okay. Like, forming is when you take like a flat sheet of metal mm -hmm. and you get it to be like, you get it to be like into a bowl shape. Right. Um, me of Atelier does this a lot. Um, oh, wow. What she's known for, bending metal, bending flat sheets of metal, almost like origami, like paper. But I, it's very dirty. I used to do miniature forming. This is sterling, this is very dirty sterling silver. <laughs> this was a flat sheet of metal at one point. So insane. So now, how long did something like that take you to do? It was many, this... many hours. I made my own tube. Mm. So I, I, wove, I wove it around here so it didn't need to have solder. It set in there perfectly. Oh, wow. So, so wait, what tool did you use to sort of create the piping? Hammers. Just knocking away at it slowly, like... So that it manipulates into, like, a... Perfect wow. little... This is I, this is when I used to like really metal stuff. Like up. really get into it. Yeah, but this is how I I would start hitting against this at different angles, and it helped me move the metal. I don't oh, know. Wow. This, so this is like I'm, I kind of I use this little mini tool a lot, and I was missing it in my home studio. So I brought it here. I did a little demo stories already because yeah, it's well because it's. <laughs> And it's interesting and it's different, but how we're doing this asymmetrical pearl bra. Yes, which I'm so excited about. And we're doing black powder put bindings on this side and then mm -hmm. aluminum and steel on this side. And yeah. look, what are you thinking about this? Because this is a bigger size. I wanted you to see that before. Yeah. I mean, I don't really notice it, it's not like an extreme difference. No, it is. Um, especially being that it has like the illusion of like the black, and I'm usually gonna. I mean, you see me here. I'm in all black, so it so will be basically invisible. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna yeah. You know. Yeah, it'll be such a small. It'll be 
such a small detail because I feel like the heaviness of that hardware will look really good with the heaviness that's going on here with all the pearls. So it'll kind of balance it out, even though it's a, har a bigger or more pronounced uh, hardware. Totally. Okay. So I, I'm cool with it. Okay, cool. Because this, like, yeah. this is what you're really going to see. Oh, yeah. That's the... The PS. Hello, hi. Your focal point for sure. Oh, hey. Okay, good. <laughs> okay. Maybe if I need more light. I'm like, maybe I need more light today. You need a little bit more lighting? I changed, yeah. I changed settings. I'm in my kitchen now. Oh, <laughs> I was like, wait, let me have like a white backdrop. <laughs> I like the, all, the, all the black, right? Yeah, all the black against the white background, of course. I love it. I love it. No, it's good. It looks like a piece of art. <laughs> Before we start, yes. hold, hold up. We need to catch up on your new bag purchase. <laughs> we, we still have got it. Just one, we need a pause. Everyone. We literally FaceTimed about this and you, we just went on to another tangent, even today. <laughs> As always, because, you know, we both are just, you have a lot of Libra energy, I'm a Libra, so we're just. <laughs> <laughs> totally. Okay, before I interrupt, keep going. So, um, in quarantine, I kind of was, I've been like saving a lot, I've been, you know, sort of like <laughs> yeah of course she's calling me out i know that's so so i was like you know what i haven't done any crazy online shopping i haven't done anything excessive or insane the only thing i've been doing is grocery shopping so i was like let yeah. me treat myself to something so um i was fo i'm following this uh artist his name is pratchett church um and he's known for doing like really cool designs on like um t-shirts and like shorts and he he does like massive paintings like wall size cool. paintings um, he has a, a studio in Brooklyn, um, and he started recently doing um, drawings onto handbags. So if you send in a bag, he will draw on it and like do do like a famous design that he does. My God, that's Bergen's bag. You know what I'm talking about? Candace Bergen paints on luxury handbags. Yeah. You know what I'm about. Yeah. yeah, yeah. On a Bergen bag, like bad. Exactly. Oh so it's like that sort of that Brooklyn. same. Hey, yeah, but probably art you know what i mean <laughs> although candace bergen not bad candace bergen i mean listen if you have a bag designed by i mean drawn on by candace bergen i mean i'm not selling that until no, i, I get to my grave <laughs> life yeah okay so this so you said what bag did you send in and what are you getting so i went to so i got i went to the the real real and i got a which is like my favorite place and i i treated myself to uh you know like the the louis vuitton like sort of mini duffel so in like the the <laughs> larger the, the largest before it turns into luggage. The Lusac was it it's called? The, the it's called the Speedy. The Speed the Speedy. So it almost looks uh, like a little duffel, but it's better for like every day. But it was yes. on sale. <laughs> it was on sale and it's vintage, so it's from 1989. It's from November of 1989. So it's like it was a really good price. It was like I wasn't breaking the bank and I wasn't you know going crazy. So. Um, I just sent it in today, so he's going to paint it by next week. Wait, what, is, what is Larry saying? I, uh, seriously. Seriously. I I'm like, um, agree. I'm writing. <laughs> Even though I just said it out loud, I'm going to actually just write it to him. At this point, I'm just going to message them and be like, hey, listen, sponsor me, please. Yeah, I mean. Just sponsor me. I'll, I'll <laughs> just send me stuff. I'll do reviews. Of them. <laughs> <laughs> so, you got that. You're sending, it, oh, you're sending it to him to do a painting. Correct. What's the so it's going to be, he does like these sort of like, um, he does like a mixture of different pieces. They're all very like abstract. Um, so this almost looks like, tr it almost looks tribal. So the design, the artist is Patrick Church. So he's from London. He just moved here maybe a couple years ago with his husband. He um, does all these like really cool, he takes like leather jackets and paints all over them with like stars and like really fun colors. It's very like this sort of Jeremy Scott feel. Yes. Uh, so it's a lot of like bright colors, very much fun, very like, can't be cool, interesting, and he'll he does this design that I'm I've loved for years, and I've always wanted either like a piece or like something with it, um, or a piece of clothing. But he draws these like almost it almost looks like native drawings, but it's like a face, it's like faces, and then like sort of like the torso of a woman. But it almost looks like you would find it on like a yeah. like a wall, like a cave wall, yeah. or something. It's like very interesting oh, cool. design. It's really cool. It's very well done, and it almost looks. 
Interesting. I love this. Yeah. Basquiat a little bit? Basquiat. Yeah, it's very Basquiat-esque. Yeah. Okay. So it's kind of like that mixture of like, it's a little bit, it's a little, it kind of reminds me of like, if I were to see um, sort of paintings on like, from cavemen, from like the original, the original people, that's what it looks like. And I loved it. And he like painted in these bright, vibrant colors. Cool. Um, so I'm doing it in like the lime green. So I'm like, I'm really, yeah, I'm like really excited. So it's gonna be like my fun quarantine, treat yourself. This is the only <laughs> thing I'm doing. And then I'm good for the, until like next year. <laughs> it's a good one though. So you're gonna have yeah. your, I mean, handbags are a work of art already, but you've like Absolutely. elevated this to a whole nother level. This is gonna be so personal. I love yeah. that you align with the like really traditional uh, uh, Louis Vuitton bag. Yeah. Right, that's gonna be. Yeah. So I'm, I'm very excited. So I should be getting it next, end of next week, so then I can show it the week after, if you want to show it, if you want me to show it. Ask me show it. <laughs> <laughs> We're always about show and tell. Are you, are you kidding? Oh, of course. <laughs> Everybody, we can do your show and tell. Like, <laughs> it's you no know me. Like, I, I get you. I get it. Like, I have. I like making so much show and tell. You definitely have so much show and tell. I yeah. We, I've been always <laughs> find new things. To find. I've been doing this jewelry edition, uh, hosting them on Monday nights. Yeah. There's a couple artists in there that I'm gonna be in trouble. You know what I mean? It's like I'm a little worried. I get it. Yeah. Especially all of those like events that you invite me to, the ones that are like hosted by either Donna or when you go to like Grand so Central, good. and you're like, oh, this is my friend so and so, and I'm like, I want everything that they have on their table. Like, <laughs> it's very dangerous. It's very. <laughs> I definitely see with Ariana Blue Star rifle ring. Uh, it's gonna happen. Um, well, I mean, you got, you, you you're like, I'm coming, I've already come to terms with it. It's already on my finger. <laughs> okay, by the way, I love your talon today. Oh, thank you. I was like, I might as well do it because we're not, I'm not doing any show and tell. I'm, I'm doing all the watching and looking at the process of this amazing bra. I know, but you're also like making decisions. We're going to do a little, we need yeah. to talk about what the girls are going to be. So I started, oh, yeah. Speaking of, okay, so, because yeah. I'm before, I was gonna put some pearls on. Mm -hmm. I was thinking, and let's just like recap really quick for people. We have yeah. three pearl color choices, and they're all gonna be on this really luscious bra, right? Oh, uh, but we need your colors. Like this is gonna be there's gonna be three different colors, so we need to choose like which colors, which ones will. another consideration I wanted to chat with before I placed anything I was immediately my first thought was like put the heavier on the bottom the bottom but then I'm like maybe that's not because these are so right. close in color this is like a blush pink and a yeah. Safe green. yeah and then we have this beautiful dark peacocky gray gun metal and has a little bit of blue tone in it too mm -hmm. yeah and and darker, darker greens. Actually, they all have like a peacock effect, which is yeah. iridescence on the, on the. So get multicolors within all of them. So that's really nice. It's gonna, it's gonna have that same tone. So it'll all look um, distant. Right. Oh, so they're so pretty. This is the one that's like about, you know, maybe one or two millimeters larger. Right. So this could go. It could really go anywhere. You know, yeah, honestly, it's, it's, there is a, there is a distinct difference, but it's not so stark that it almost looks like it'll be, it'll be close it would look a little odd. It wouldn't look odd because okay. it's not that, it, there's not a huge difference. So I, I like, I feel like I would like it on one of the, the top ones. The dark, the bigger one. Do you want it yeah. in outside? Right? Anybody? See, I love it. So please chime in because we got. Yeah. Out. It's like because we're we're gonna also do we did it we did a not we did an equilateral. No, no, no. I saw Sylvie's triangle. Two sides. Yeah. Are gonna be a little bit a little longer. Bit bigger. Yeah. So just like just an inch, not a ton, but it gives us a little bit more because you're taller. Yeah. It'll look good still. So, what do you think on that? Um. You want me to put some, let's see, let me put some, I'm going to try, 
darker on the darker inside. on the inside. Yeah, I think that's better. Let's see what. Let's see. I can always take it apart. It's not set in stone, you know. No, totally. Uh, Sarah wants you to to show you the drawing so you can visualize better. Okay. So she can visualize better, rather. Yeah. So we're talking dark pearls here. Mm -hmm. I really wish I had. Dark pearls here. Yeah. And then green or pink on the bottom. Mm -hmm. And then one or the other. I don't know whichever one you want. I would do pink here and green here. I agree. I was just about to say that. See, this is why, oh. this is why we're friends. Well, because these two, I mean, for sure. <laughs> um, I totally get my vision and they make me go further, you know? Yeah. That's what, that's how we collaborate. That's, that's how things get made and new designs come out and it's all about collaboration. Love it. Okay, I'm gonna put a couple on. Um, what else is gonna go on? <sighs> Honest, <laughs> nothing really, just, uh, <laughs> just grocery shopping, trying to stay sane. I've been watching yeah. quite a few movies, so I'm, I'm oh, excited okay. about that. Um, so I actually watched, so I'm really, in, I'm starting to get more into horror. Um, it took me 26 years of my life to get into it. So, okay, that looks so good. Yeah. How fun, you guys. And I'm going to try on some pieces. So stay tuned at the end. We have, like, good, fun announcements. Yeah. I'm excited for those. We were talking about a couple, so we're like, I'm excited which, what we, what we came up we on or... We're gonna, we're gonna, yes, horror films. Oh, okay, yes, yes, horror So I've been getting more into that. So actually tonight we're gonna watch uh, this film called The Lodge. Um, I don't know if you've heard of it. I've never, I'm scared still, scared. <laughs> Maybe watch it in the daytime. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I did. <laughs> that's my favorite emoji, my favorite. I use that when I'm really mad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The stabby feels, right? Uh, yeah, so it's, it's, I'm excited. Uh, I'm like so excited to like watch this process go on, just seeing all the pearls come together and uh, oh my it's God, like little, little stepping stones. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks so good. Well, this is like, it's funny because people are like, how long does it take to make a piece? I'm like, it's not making it, it's designing it. Yeah, that's what takes the longest. <laughs> oh, it's not a <laughs> super, whoops, definitely not instantaneous. No. It's not here. No. Yeah. I mean, for example, like the the harness that you made for me prior, it took me a long time to figure out what I even wanted. Yeah. That took and me it took like... Fitting. It took us multiple fittings. Yeah. And then I had to dust it on you at the end. Yep. And I'm putting, I'm attaching this, so we're going to have like a ring here, a okay. ring here. Okay. So I know. Gonna pick the shape. Yeah. But it's going to be a little bit smaller scale, so that's going to be another like... Um, movement point, which will give it, it, it'll fold back. I'm here for that. I, me too. I, you know, I love movement. I love it when it. Me too. It has a little bit more to it. <laughs> you know, I like well, drama. Do. You can do more things with it also. Exactly. You I can know? move it around. Yeah. I can. So this is the tool that I'm using. Awesome. This is like the, mm, so satisfying. It really, it's, this, this is a tool. You know? That is, that is some serious business. That's the fact that you have to like unhinge it for it to work frightens me. So I know that it's like a serious thing. Oh, I have a, another one. You know that huge ball chain I made you? Remember the one that was like from here? The eight millimeter. Huge bullshit. Eight millimeter. Yeah. Okay, I have to have a specialty cut for that because the steel is so hard. Like it will melt my saw blade. So a special cut with jaws like this big, like a like a huge cutter. It has a has a, one of these on it, and I'm like hmm. almost a two. That's too small for that. It has it's that size for a machine that massive. Or is it just the same mechanism? Just it's, really, it's the same size, but the jaws start down here. 
the access point is oh, way no. down, so the jaws are like this big. So it has to be like with two hands because it open. It's really that sounds intense. It's really another fun tool. I feel like I buy all these. These are for men. They're not specifically for jewelry because I do. A, this is not traditional jewelry making. No, I've adapted no. This other visual language, so more like larger, more more fun, like sculptural. And I got all these weird man tools. Yeah, <laughs> man tools. Yeah, you have like, like a separate segment. Like here are all my man tools. And they, but you know what? They're better made. I, I can exactly. Tell. They can take a beating. They can, you know, you can really go in on them. Yeah. Oh, so good. How are we feel? I mean, I feel like. I literally feel like I want to take a bottle of champagne and hit it against the ship because we started. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Well, we had, it took a while to get the right thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you can see it's going to be like this. Okay. I feel like because I'm not the same size as you, obviously, this is going to be an appropriate scale for you. Yeah. A boob. Yeah. Boobage. 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 Uh, yes. Okay. Try. So I'm gonna do the pink layer on the bottom. Okay. So keep... Yeah. Perfect. Oh, this is so cool. I love. I love. Like, every... every time we, I feel like we like come together and like collaborate on this. It's like, I'll see you do bits and pieces and bits and bobs here and there, but. I never actually see you fully do it. So the fact that I'm seeing this on live and I'm not even there is insane. You'll usually like turn away and just like be like, la, 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 here are all my man tools. I'm going to clamp this and that. And then it comes out and it's like in full fruition. A bottle of wine together, hanging out. A bottle of wine, yeah. Playing some music. Like fun salami and cheese sometimes. Yeah, a little charcuterie, you know. I That's feel like it's I'm like a... I feel like I'm at like, you know, personal shopping and they're like, oh, here's, here's this couture piece that <laughs> I love that. I never even thought, I never even thought about yeah. that. Well, that's, that's it's very much like a good, it's amazing. I love it. It's, I love honestly, being a host. Remember, it's a couture piece and a work of art that you make and all jewelry people make. It's, it's that's special. Really nice. Yeah. That's a, I really like the way that, that way of thinking about it. Cause fashion is that too. Very much so has that all that like the purse the purse you just like custom made and custom you basically just custom designed a purse yeah absolutely <laughs> so it's like an exciting process so i just love seeing all of this stuff being made into fruition yeah yeah that this looks color fantastic color, i feel like this for pink you would you just okay but i i obviously like stalk you and then i put like a million cute pictures in my instagram stories <laughs> But, oh my God, I love it. No, it's, that's what it's there for. But that red suit you were wearing? What is that? that that's very stunning. It's from ASOS. And I paid $60 for the blazer and pants. What? I know. Yeah. Yeah, it looks real because nobody, I feel like, especially people that are like my size, so I would be considered like plus size in the industry because I'm usually range between an XL and an extra, extra large, um, just depending on how baggy I want the piece to be. Um, so it's like, I feel like a lot of people that are my size, there's there's such a small fraction of people that like, if, of men that want to have like these very like out there interesting colors and like bright colors and like want to be seen. So it's like, I felt like a lot of the suits that were, I was looking for were like black, navy. Mm -hmm, boring. Blah, blah. I can get that anytime a tan suit. I'm like, I don't need that. So I saw this bright red suit and I was like, okay, it had my, it had my size and it wasn't really sold because I guess people are a little bit more self-conscious about getting a bright red suit. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to get it. And it was on deep, deep sale. So I got the whole set and it's one of the best things I ever bought. Right? Yeah. I, it's I, such a power suit. Like it could, it, this is sounds, this is going to sound terrible. It could be like a Santa Claus. People Absolutely. Could, I think they, that's probably what also what no, could translate the, as. Especially me with a beard. I know, but it, in no way does it look that way. It's super, it looks like you You look like you're in a movie, like a James Bond movie or something. I don't know. It has like a 60s a little flair or something. Like clean lines. I like that. Thank you. Okay, here we're going to be a little short. Kind of, okay, it's going to be shorter. Yeah, I have to leave like a this for me to make the little jump ring thing. 
Understood. But this is the shorter. This is the shorter side. As the front, the this is going to be the the bottom. And then yes, it's going to be shorter. A little, bit. a little bit. A little bit. Yeah, because we're making we're accounting for this humongous ring being. Yeah. Part of the so. circumference uh, around. Got it. So that's why we added. We took about an inch on each side because there's like. Okay. So we're trying to make it so it's going to look, it's going to fall. Work If it doesn't work, we we'll have to cut it up and remake it. So that And then we'll just do a whole other series on that one. <laughs> no, I'll cut it, it up and do a camera and then remake it and no one will know. <laughs> or that. <laughs> totally. Yeah. So this one I'm going to leave with no end because I'm going to attach another one to here and here. Perfect. Oh my god, it looks so good! You're getting the green out next. That's my favorite one. My favorite color is that green. Because it's like a sagey. I'm completely attracted to it. It's like mermaid y. Yeah. A little bit, right? A little mermaid. It's like mermaid in the fall. It's like a darker green. It's like a. Yeah. It is like a darker green. You're right. Mermaid in the fall. And it's a little bit. It's not emerald. Right. So it's like a, oh, I can't describe that color. I like that. I like that mermaid like in the fall. Too. Like olive -y, like more autumnal. More less <laughs> okay. You know, they have a, you know, they have a, a massive wide brim hat and a camel coat and then like burgundy boots and like, you know. <laughs> look great with that. All these colors with camel, oh, yeah. cream, Ooh, so elegant. With camel. Might be here for that. Camel coat? I feel like you do. I do. I actually have one. I have one from um, H and M, and that's one of the best yeah. ones. I had one that was like more expensive, but it, it just it didn't hold up well. So I got I, I sold it. Really? Yeah. Weird. You, you find some of these special pieces in fast fashion, and they work. Isn't that funny? But it's that for me. It's far and few between. It is really, and I think. What do you think is going to happen now? Okay, by the way, we should talk about J. Crew, And, like, we tried about it. <laughs> that Andre Leon Talley, I just saw that biography. We talked about it a little bit last week. I'm like, holy moly. Yeah. Right. Yeah, it's, it's rough. Like, yeah, it's A lot of stuff has been going on in the industry <laughs> this past, like, two weeks. So, Neiman Marcus is Chapter 11. Yep. Officially. J. Crew is Chapter 11. Officially, including Madewell. Then you I have. Madewell needed that. No, Madewell didn't need that. They should have had it as a separate entity. But I guess you know, when the captain goes with the ship, the whole thing goes down. So, okay. I guess okay. that's how they're that's how they're playing it. But um, then there's. Because it'll make it more it'll make it more um, attractive if someone wants to buy it if they have Madewell with it. Well, then the problem is, is that Madewell goes out of business if they're going that route. I, I'm pretty sure they're going Chapter 11, which just means that, you know, they'll just have to revamp and restructure. Um, I hope it doesn't just go down the Barney's route, because that'll be sad. That and then same with, oh, that was, that was sad. They, like, blew it up. They're like, let's just blow it up. I felt so bad, because, so I went, I went towards the end when I was, I was like, there's still stuff, and I was trying stuff on, whatever. I remember I took Larry, and Larry had never been to that Barney's, to the one on Madison. Oh, that, oh, that green looks so good. It looks good and, with the pink, too. Yeah. No, it looks beautiful. And he saw it and was just like, "You can, we can leave. This is sad. <laughs> Wait, it didn't feel like you no, could... It, they, were selling per, they were selling Persian rugs on the first floor. Like, that has nothing to do with the brand. If it was, like, a Macy's, I would understand, but it was... A Barney's that has never sold or really sold houseware like that, like furniture. So it was just very what? weird. How did that happen? Look at, so they were just like having different vendors come in and just sell their stuff. I know the pink is so good. Wait, what? I don't understand then. It was mm -hmm. grim. Oh, it was. It was grim. Why did they bring the Persian rug people in just because they wanted They just that wanted money. to make extra money that they had to pay off that they owe, that they owe all their vendors. Whoa. Yeah, is... they owed a lot of money. Uh, you can see it. It's coming together, you guys. 
I That's love great. that combination. That combination is so good. Yeah. We did that. Everyone who ch everyone who voted on the colors. Thank you. You're the best. Thank you. I love when people vote, by the way. So we're going to have more of that next week. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm here for that. I'm here for that. Well, because it's fun and, like, it's always interesting. Yeah. You know? and I love your, like, uh, go for it. No, 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 no. I was in the same thing. No, I said I love... I love seeing like people's opinions, maybe different sides of the story, um, how they see something. Cause that's the beauty of collaboration. You can just, everyone comes in, they say, I see it on this end, I see it on this end. And then you come together and you create something beautiful. So I'm always here for people. <laughs> you are such a people person. I love I, it. Um, I miss people. I know. <laughs> hey, Matt, hey, at the bar, like, let me be your best friend. So the bartender, I'm like, oh my. <laughs> I'm like, do you know that person? Oh yeah, the last time we went out, yeah. We got wings. <laughs> and that girl were like, be at, I was like, this is the cutest thing ever. Oh, she was so sweet. Was she, looked like she, she looked like she was having like a little bit of a rough day. So I was like, hey she girl, how are you herself. doing? Yeah. She was by herself and no one was helping her. And she nope. had to do all the orders and make the drinks. So I was like, well, that sucks. Yeah, that's that was rough. I felt super cool, you guys. So good. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to uh, bind it off. So, Sweet. So are you going to use that same closure as the, the, the circle? The, yeah, I'm, I'm going to. So we're basically attaching it up here. So I've, oh. I've gone here to here to here. OK. And now I'm attaching it here. So we're doing this. So it's going to be a little point. And then from there, I'll be able to attach the next point. Amazing. I don't know if that's too many circles, I think. No. We'll I, don't think so, I think they're pretty separated. And if and once we see it on, exactly. Once we see it on, we can change it. Yep. I was like, this was like my first idea, but then if it's too many points, we'll see. You know. Sometimes we'll, it's like something like, around. And then it's not. Well, whatever. Let's see how it goes. I'm here um, for it. You know what it's kind of reminding me of? Like a candy necklace. Have you ever? You know, like the. That's what it reminds me of. I love that. Because it's like, like all the different colors and. Mm-hmm. I love and that. A little bit too. Some of them have like it's more uniform. Because the pearls. Like yes. candy. Mm, sounds It'd good. be a bunch of different colors, but like because of all the colors, it's kind of like a separated you know like when the Rolling Stones used to say, like, I want M and M's, but I only want the green M and M's. Yes. It's like that. <laughs> that's like their that's their way to get make sure people watch read the contract, right? Yeah. Oh, I love that. Okay. So here, it is like a candy necklace, but grown up. But it's way grown up. Yeah, I love, I love the grown up. Yes. That would be cool to have like an attachment, detachable, detachable thing. So. <gasps> yeah. This is this is a process, honey. <laughs> this is, I love it. Two, 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 two. Right. Okay. Here for it. Oh yes. I'm here, I'm here for this here. I love it there. I love the texture, the difference of texture here. Because the other ones are a little bit more smooth. Yeah, you're right, because they're a little bit rougher. Yeah. Whereas those are a little bit more symmetrical and that has just like that natural. I love that because it just sits right here. It's like an added texture. I'm here for that. I love that. And this, I feel, this is nice to have these two kind of are a little bit more in the same cool tone family. Yeah. But they're not matching, which is nice. Okay. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm going to build awesome. the last, We're going to do a little hammer hammer. Okay. I'm going to get some more wine before we do this. <laughs> oh, wait. Because I'm going to show you. I did a little up close. Yeah, get that wine. Mm, everybody refill. Everyone refill. Thanks for joining, everybody. We're doing, we're, and we're really getting in here. So we've gotten half of the front done. We've designed this. And this is cool because this is, look at this, is totally detachable. Oh, what? Oh, okay. There, mm -hmm. see. It's gonna then attach in the back. It'll be all one piece, like a vest you put on, and you attach mm -hmm. it to the center point. Which is why I'm saying we could have other things that attach 
a choker here and then drops down and attaches here and clips on. Yeah, almost like a a four. In, it's almost at this point, it's like a four or five in one necklace. Like, <laughs> oh, that's why I love. I'm obsessed with these rings because they, it gives me these um, places to attach things to in a nice way. But everything lays nicely, like a yeah. jump ring. Basically, jump rings and jewelry. This is what you do, but I'm doing it in humongous hardware form. <sighs> so good. So good. <laughs> good. And if it's not good, we'll remake it. But I'm thinking it's not. It's definitely going to be, be perfect. perfect. You know? Yeah, no, I think it's going to be perfect. Okay. I need to refill still because I started talking. Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. It's been one oh, of those wow. days. <laughs> Guilty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, right? I mean, listen, it happens. I mean, I, I've heard you've been, I've heard you've been, uh, you've been busy. Mother's Day is, uh, is coming up. Everyone's looking for jewelry. You guys, I overnighted today. I got you. Oh my God. And then we also are just doing, like, I did this, oh, I did this new red piece because I was kind of quite a lot. Oh um, yeah, you were, you were showing it to me today, like uh, earlier today. So I, I think like I'm going to have have some people interested oh Let's yeah see. that's i mean that's a stunning piece and i love the colors <gasps> but see the di i love this because the different i mean like rem it reminds me of obviously you do the crochet with the silver or the gold and all of that but this actually looks like cloth until you come up to it mm -hmm. this really looks like a sweater like an that ugly is... sweater and then i made it into a necklace exactly but see like i, I love it because it it's almost like a trompe l'oeil because it looks like you just have like yarn, but in reality, it's actually little, uh, little, little scarf. It's like a little uh, ball chain. It's fantastic, but I, oh, it's so good. This is that industrial. This one I literally took dog tags. You can see all the little connectors in there. Oh yeah. I kept them all, they're all little like short necklaces. I kept them all apart. Mm -hmm all together to make my own like fabric or yarn and then yeah. sort of knit and then crocheted like, oh, wow. little, little, like blending of both right yeah i love the mixture of colors I think those are yes it is <laughs> hi mom <laughs> i do need a full sweater okay larry will talk I, do, I think it'd be cool to do some like little like poncho kind of little fabric-y. In that crochet? Absolutely. It almost looked like a, like metal. So it almost looked like some sort of Joan of Arc. Oh, it'll be, it'll be chain mail -y good. Yeah. If I can figure it out. I mean, I have to figure out the weight, but I think- Yeah, that, that's gonna be pretty heavy though. Oh yeah. You're gonna yeah. feel it for sure. <laughs> yeah. But some I made this other piece that was so big, so almost like, it was like a um, gravity blanket. And she was like, I feel, I like it. Oh, so it was a good feeling. I hope, did she like fall asleep from it or? <laughs> <laughs> or she just felt like comfortable? She felt comfortable. She was like, mm -hmm. okay, good. She was very, like a yogini and very mm. in space, yeah, Bay area girls. You know, my, my other side, my non New York side. I was like, yes, the yeah. vibes are there. The vibes. I, I, like, <laughs> I um, love it. Mm hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna attach black part, black powder coated um, little tubes to mm -hmm. one of these rings. We're gonna do, we're gonna mirror the other side, but without the pearls now. So pearls. this is gonna be this fun, a fun um, little experiment to see. We're also gonna see how it weight. It might. I'm a little worried the weight would be off. Yeah. But we'll see, because really the most weight is here, so this might actually help that this is Yeah, used. it'll probably hold it all together, definitely. Engineering, physics, who knew? Okay, so we do you do? <laughs> <laughs> you know, math and reading were kind of important. Yeah, absolutely. I feel like especially <laughs> if you go into design work or you go into, me into anything that has to do with measuring, I feel like geometry and like, all of that is very key, especially like making patterns. Oh. Really? I look at people making patterns and I'm just like, this is it's, like brain surgery to me. It's really a whole thing. Yeah. 
pat pattern making because I designed the patterns for the knits. Um, mm -hmm. Actually, Ada Chen, you know Ada, my girl. Yeah. Um, my sweet, sweet thing. So I was like, uh, she's been knitting because she's like, she's a maker, you know? Yeah. Just do something like, with her hands. Yeah. Yes. It's hard. She can't go to her studio either. Cut. She's also locked out of her studio. Ugh, so, that's horrible. Um, FYI, we're going to run out of here. That means so um, get those earrings while you can. Oh, yes. Those are a hot commodity. I know I have, I'm, I'll be able to make some eventually, but it's just gonna take a little logistics issue right now with all this. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Look at my sweet, sweet hot mess. <laughs> um, people who work all clean and stuff, that's good for you. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I love it. It's a bit of a challenge. It's, um, Listen. Carl Lagerfeld had the most disorganized desk, yeah, ran Chanel for like 300 years. But I, okay, so what, I honestly, it doesn't matter that I'm here. It would be like this. <laughs> I mean, guilty. I don't, I don't create in a clean way. No, um, so honestly, it's an organized mess. So it's not like, yeah. it's not like you can't find anything that you need. Totally, no, totally. I'll make sure you can see that. Okay, so I use the anvil. I'm gonna, it's a little, I don't wanna like transfer the color of this powder coating to the steel. Yeah. But use a little inky underneath so that okay. it, the, oh, the that's anvil smart. protects the metal. Smart. A little oh my god, this is so cool. I finally get to see the anvil in, in, in use. This is gonna be good. Um, I usually, so I, on, you, I'm just using a simple mallet. When I get bigger and bigger and bigger, it get really hard to get more. I have these big metal hammers, and I have to go to town. But this, because it's actually copper powder coated, mm -hmm. copper softer, so it's not like the aluminum or the steel, which is great. Right. So, like at this point, you might as well just start blacksmithing. <laughs> for real. <laughs> okay, I have done. I, well, no, I did. You know what I, I really liked was. Um, TIG welding. Oh. Welding's like fabrication and soldering, but for men. <laughs> Yet again. But That's really, ladies are into it too. It's like how all those yeah. like cool gates are made and stuff. So I don't have this, so I'm going to only hammer softly. Okay. On. I want to make that this is all even, so I'm slowly. Nope. Raw, raw. I know, it's okay, but that's, let me see if I can fix it. There you so, go, see? So it popped out because it's really, really, really doesn't want to stay in there. It's really springy. Mm -hmm. This is the like all. So I'm gonna try to put it back in. Oop, I got it. So now I'm gonna, see I've hammered it somewhat. Yeah. But oh, yes. Yeah, it's flattened, it's, yeah. So it's hard to keep them this on this side and this come on this side. It's what, one of my challenges. And to make sure this little end stays in, doesn't fall apart, and then this slowly connects. So let's, let's get it. Let's do it. <laughs> Isn't it funny? Oh, my God. This is nuts. No. Oh, there we did. We did it. Sweet. Boom. Yeah. Boom. Boom. One side connected. Oh yeah. That is With an like anvil. Amazing. That is still so nuts to me. I just like I picture like an anvil with like I picture like a swordsmith with like a massive fire behind them, just like hammering away at like. <laughs> You don't have to necessarily heat up the metal to hammer it. Depends on the metal. Really? It's probably like, I'm assuming steel and stuff when you want to like shape it out. Oh, steel, yes. There's a whole, okay, but with steel though, when, as soon as you heat it up too high, you lose mm -hmm. the strength of it, it becomes brittle and breaks. So you have to remake it, you have to do a special heating thing to steel to make it hard again. I you have no it idea. Past, it's the whole, Okay, but because all the tools are made of steel. If you're right. a metalsmith, you know how to use your tools. Right. I do. Not, so I. 
<laughs> we'll That's a whole other process. <laughs> we'll get into that later. There's like way better people at this, but I do know about it because I've had I've worked in a full metal studio. Sure. Um, and worked in a casting house where we like would make things from molds. Mm -hmm. But this getting that other one on there. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, it's gonna look no, so good. To... This one we're gonna I'm gonna do by itself. That's right. Okay. It is gonna look good. Right? It's getting springy. Oh, I might do one more and then we should talk about I'm gonna try some stuff on. Our, our yeah. Show. I'm like, oh my gosh, the time is flying. We're getting know, there though. Sick. It's so funny, we'll literally you know us. <laughs> it took like how would we go through it like thanks for being here and listening to us because <laughs> I know seriously just ramble for forty six minutes. <laughs> I made like a couple of things. I put some pearls on. Yes. That takes you put, a moment. You did a whole side. Now you're doing the other yeah. side. Yeah. This is huge. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Remember that, Megan. Remember that. Tell me, tell, keep telling me I'm productive. I like that. You're productive. You're productive. <laughs> you're productive. Yeah, it's like, it's like you, if you can't. <laughs> I feel like you just have that written on your wall. You're productive. I agree. I would feel so much better. You have accomplished <laughs> today, Megan. Amazing. We did that. Wee. So now we're going to connect one more mm -hmm. and we'll have a perfect. So excited. I'm so excited. It's going to be all floaty on this side, totally. Oh, I'm here for it. It's like the movement, lightweight. It's lightweight. It's like industrial, but lightweight at the same time, which is it's a little bit dainty. It's not so. Yeah. It's not leather like leather daddy. Um, no. <laughs> you know, it's gonna be. It's, yeah. little, it's different. Yeah. And then this is gonna actually probably. Um. Be, this will probably won't hang so much because we're gonna actually go all the way around, so it'll it'll okay. and have, it'll kind of pull out probably. I'm guessing. Okay. Um, well, we're gonna see, right? We're gonna see. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna have fun with it. We're gonna make it work, as Tim Gunn would say. Yeah, I, honestly. <laughs> on, right? Did you, did you watch the make? Did you watch Making the Cut? The new one. I watched bits and pieces. Uh huh. I, yeah, I know. Some people were not into it. I I thought some of the people were very talented, but I just, Ooh. I wasn't, I mean, we're not obviously fantastic. Love. Good and clean pieces, beautifully done, beautifully made. Just some yeah. of the people, I'm like, you're, you're competing for a million dollars and this is the level of work that you do? Million dollars, you guys. Yeah, but I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna shade anybody that's, you know, working, but... I do like working. I mean, we all do. Right? Exactly. I mean, we all like working, being creative, and, you know, everyone has their own taste, but I just felt like it wasn't... Some some people just weren't to par, and that's just my opinion. Yeah, a million dollars was... They really made a splash with that, right? Yeah. I yeah, mean, the, 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 the judges... Yeah. The judges were all A-list. Yeah. Okay, I live for Naomi. That's my aunt in my mind. <laughs> oh, I mean, for real, right? Like, mm -hmm. she is your aunt. That is, I love how you're just like casually putting this on in front of me, like, as well, though I'm not going to react. <laughs> That's what, let's talk about other pieces. I was like, let's, you know what people love? I'm mean, like, keep getting feedback is try it on stuff. Show us things. Yeah. So I'm like, I okay. love this. This is like a, I've seen before, but it's just like, I love seeing it on. It's, it's way different. I haven't seen, you haven't made this in a while. No, I remade it. I love it. Well, because I had another one, the one I made before I sold it, or mm -hmm. I sold a couple. Mm -hmm. the, the last one I sold was Palm Spring Modernist Week. Oh, someone, oh yeah. Someone to wear to a gala, right? Perfect clientele. <laughs> oh, totally my clientele. They all have houses here. One of them still texts me, because we're in this, because my name starts with an M. And she has a group 
all her friends with people with the first name start with M is part of her group. Fantastic. So in my name, I was like, okay. <laughs> You're like, listen, I'll take it. <laughs> super sweet, like super sweet mm -hmm. California and New York. I love that. Yeah. But I feel like, like that works that works in New York, definitely, for like a good gala, good art show, a store opening. I mean, I can't wait for a store to open. Thank you, thank you. I want a store to open. I want to go shopping or walk around or something. I just, exactly. I just want to walk into places and say hi to people. Yeah. And just yeah. go to a restaurant and do all of that. So I'm very excited for that. So I feel like the first time I will go out, I'll be in full regalia and it's just to a bar. Like <laughs> amazing as always. So yeah. no doubts there of any no problem. Okay, so I brought some <laughs> pieces because we uh -huh. discussed doing a giveaway. Yes. Based on the stuff we're doing with the pearl harness. And I want I'm putting some pieces out there and I basically it's Michael's choice. Yes. So we're, it's Michael's choice for the first round, and then we're gonna do a poll throughout the week, and then he's ultimately going to choose one of the pieces and the winner next Friday. Oh, I am. Oh, we added this responsibility to me. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. I'm here for it. It's like, cause then it's like not up. To, it's not on me. That's great. You're like, listen, the less responsibility. Yes. Hi, I also feel like, hello, it's my cousin Bernice. <laughs> okay, so. What I'm just putting out are some pieces that are the same concept of what we're doing. It's mm -hmm. pearls. It's all freshwater pearls. Uh, and they're woven on these steel cables with aluminum. And all of these parts come, all of these things come off. Mm -hmm. And this can become like a bracelet. Also. So it can be a necklace. I didn't know all of that. Yeah, that's I've seen that piece. I don't know about all of that. I changed it up. So this one I did. See. Like a little Saturn's rings with little mm -hmm. moons as the pearls. And it's like what the rules we decided are all you have to do to win this is like show up next Friday and follow mm -hmm. both of us. Yep. So if you're not following both of us, follow both of us now. Yeah. And just tune in next week while we continue exactly. on. It's, it's, a it's a pretty, I think it's a pretty easy yeah. contest to go into. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, this is like 300 200 to 300 dollars pieces usually I'm trying to put out there. Not yeah. crazy, but like fun. These are like, this is what I wear a lot. This is the, I brought some black. With I the love that. Like we're using black in a really cool way. Exactly. I don't want to like, like that a little bit. Mm -hmm. So this is one. And this is the one you can wear. Oh, I love it. Put it through your arm, do a whole, yes. This is why you can wear multiples. So it is like more of an optical illusion because these pearls are going to float. Yeah. But see, I love the, I love the, the, like the black, the black on black or like the black t-shirt with the black um, uh, industrial steel. It's industrial steel, but it's coated, right? Yeah. It's, this one has a black nylon coating over it. Okay. Which I think, I know, Larry, ooh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> But what I love about it is, is that it, it blends into the shirt. So it almost looks like as though anything that's on it is floating. Yeah. At, at first glance. I mean, like, I, um, I love one, that detail. This one is also the, one of the um, curators for Antiques Roadshow. Mm -hmm. that assigned, I think she owns this as well. Because she was like, this is, this is the blending of modern with dust with antique and that you're playing with all these ideas like she was like get what you're doing. absolutely i this think that's the like perfect i think that's actually one of the perfect definitions of like your collections I it's like a mixture of like super love that thank you because that's that's my mom it's east meets west yeah my family is racial yep. we come through my mom's first generation mm -hmm. um we have midwest from my dad from flint michigan we have mm -hmm. my mom's from china um yeah. And both, right? I'm both. Right yeah. Now. So it's like a nice, bl I really like that. I really like that if we have old timey things and. Oh, that's so beautiful. And it almost looks like, this piece almost looks like a, like a Grecian goddess, especially when you put it on the side. Mm -hmm. That was like a, yeah. This is like very simple, but, but it's can like, also simple yeah. you can start playing with. Yeah. Doing, I really like, like what you're wearing is so great. Um, you have really good 
Yeah, Michael has really nice pictures on his profile of him oh, wearing yeah. this. This oh, has yeah. that little girls in there too. And I put a little oh, like that right there. Just so that they can, it's almost like a little stopper. Just a little. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then I put this one right here. Oh, okay. Then I have two traditional pieces. Mm -hmm. um, more like chains. This is black with the. Just simple oh, chains. Yeah. And it totally floats, but this has light gray pearls. That's beautiful. It has a, it feels, it's a simple chain, but it's not a simple chain. Mm -hmm. and what I love about it is, is that it has the, it's just clean. It's clean towards the, the siding. And then it just has this really cool detail that's transitional into like any outfit. You can wear it for day or for night. And it's just it's just very clean, but it has this really cool detailing to it. I know, you guys. Anyone want to chime in? What do you think should be the like giveaway? What should we give away next week? Okay, look. This one is the same as the black. But yeah. And I put more of the like white pearls in there, like very traditional, but not traditional again. This is like the way I started, and I started with the black. So what we're doing now is bringing all the things together, which really is. Oh, this is gonna be such a fun. Oh um, yeah. And I have this. Both. This oh, is yeah. a really I, fun piece I showed you earlier. You showed me this earlier. Yeah, I really like this one. Yeah. This one has white pearls. Mm -hmm. and I kind of made it a fun, it's like based on engineering. This moves mm -hmm. different. Beautiful. Yeah. For some I love it because you can move it into different angles and it has a different story to it, it has a different look to it. But I also love that it kind of, it kind of works very well with you know, what we're doing now, with, especially with the black, the black industrial steel, the black, uh, or with the goals. And I feel like that's just such a good presentation. Two -tone. And the two-tone. I love that. With the pearls. It does feel like these float a little bit, right? Yeah. I like the right. Yeah. Yeah. You know, this one, but this, because this one is like, I really like it like this. This is how I envisioned it, I think. I think, I don't know. This is how you envision it as an artist, but anyone can interpret it differently. I, but this well, is your this is your exactly, view. Exactly, that's exactly what I really want to say that because everyone, like you especially, you take the pieces and give them such new life because of how you wear them, what you're thinking of with your outfits, and that's that's a really enjoy. Nothing to do with me. Thank you. I mean, that's how you collaborate. Totally. You, that's how you play it around. You have a little fun. You. You know yeah and this one i feel like okay so this is one of the, so there's this one let's do a little recap okay also just okay. because this, this one's really cute and we have like a minute i made a mini no cool, right? so that sit that sits like right at the neck yeah the choker almost it's almost like what you were just wearing in the with the red i know but i made a mini and these both come off and this just becomes its own thing I don't know why I did this, but it, this one gets it's so much fun though. Like, whoa, right? Like funky, funky. Okay, so there's this one, this one, black, Grecian. Okay. Simple chain, white pearls. Uh huh. Black chain, gray pearls with the floats, mm -hmm. and then we have classic. Right. Rings, Saturn's rings, or oh, yeah. a mini with the bracelet. With the and bracelet, that was a really good one. I love. I mean, I love them all. I know we gotta, uh, show, we gotta show them as a bracelet. That's crazy. And it fits multiple people. You can put your hand if you're sm small, wristed. You can put your hand mm -hmm. into here. You can put it. Which rings? Oh Does that make God. sense? People. Yeah. It's good about being flexible, right? Absolutely. I mean, everyone has a different size. Everyone fits differently, so. I love that. Yeah, that's fantastic. And that's why like options for you, so it can fit multiple people. So Michael has a bunch of options. I'm going to photograph yeah. them. You guys are going to weigh in. It's going to make a really awesome decision. Yes. Photograph them on the body, because I feel like when okay, you put them perfect. on, I feel like it was, like, perfection. On, yes, on the mannequin, perfect. Okay, because I think. Especially it's with that Grecian one, I loved it on the side, too. Because it doesn't look right otherwise. I completely agree. 
I yeah. want to say thank you. As, uh, thank you again. We have 10 seconds. Michael, yes. a pleasure as always. Always okay. a pleasure. Thank, thank you, you so much. I'm so